Hey, what is going on guys and welcome back to another player review here on my channel. Today I have Cristiano Ronaldo and I wanted to wait till he goes down under 1 million coins but I thought hey I want to play him so I tried him in uh, Foot Champions and I played 15 games in Foot Champions with him. One game was a disconnect which didn't count to my statistics so but you still see it here so it's 15 games uh, with Cristiano Ronaldo and it was worth it and before I show you the scenes we quickly go over his stats so he has a high low work rate he's six foot two high his preferred foot is the right one five star skill moves and four star weak foot and obviously he plays in Italy but his nationality is Portuguese and I gave him a hunter camp style with the hunter camp style his acceleration goes up to 97 his sprint speed goes up to 99 his attacking positioning goes up to 99 finishing to 99 the shot power goes up to 99, the long shots stay at 93, the volleys go up to 99 and the penalties go up to 94. In the passing category he has a vision of 82, crossing 84, free kick accuracy of 76, short passing 82, a long pass with 77 and a curve of 81. And I know many people also play him with the engine camp style but I decided I want to play him with the hunter camp style because for me the speed is more important than the juiced up passing capabilities or the juiced up balance because it's mostly balance, agility and the dribbling which gets boosted which for me he's my main striker so these stats are more than enough because he gets the through balls, he can run towards the goal and anyways he is pretty responsible with these dribbling stats speaking of those agility 87 balance 71 that's the only little minus on this card but i had no problems at all with that maybe one situation but who knows if it was the balance or if it was the bad gameplay reactions 95 ball control 92 dribbling 88 and a composure of 95 so really really nice stats in all those four first categories I think for the defense stats we don't need to look any further uh, besides the heading accuracy which is at 90 and the jumping at 95 and I can tell you uh, if he gets a header he is most likely to finish this as well. Stamina with 84 is also pretty nice for the striker if you play him in a different role maybe in more in a cam role where he has to run a bit more. Uh, it's a bit critical towards the extra time, but 84 is more than enough for the striker, so he survived most games. Uh, strength of 78 and aggression of 63. And for the player traits, he has the flare trait, the power free kick, the outside foot shot, and for the CPU, the speed dribbler and the long shot taker. And I would say we jump into the scenes. I'll show you some of the best scenes of his 15 weekend league games, and then I'll be back for the final verdict.
All right, final verdict with Cristiano Ronaldo. I mean, you've already seen some nice goals now with him, also some misses, but you know, every player will miss. There's no single player in FIFA which will score every opportunity for you. Some of them were a bit bad, I have to say, but it's the gameplay as well. I mean, for me, I never get a better connection than 24 milliseconds, but that's how it is. But as you can see, in 15 games, like I said, one game was disconnect. Right in the beginning of the game, the opponent decided to go out. So it's 15 games of weekend league for champions. 21 goals scored and 11 assists and that's pretty pretty nice so that's more than two contributions per game what i noticed so far was that his dribbling is really nice even with the hunter cam style he's pretty responsible for me even on a bad connection i mean there are some games where you don't see anything from him but in this game most likely the whole team will not do much i'm pretty sure almost everyone had this problem now or then I mean, I'm also not like an elite player or something. I'm a casual player. I'm a gold two, gold three player. And yeah, for me, I mean, the speed is really nice. He goes through quite often. He has really intelligent ways to run. And I also like him in real life. I mean, this man is a machine and you see it. I mean, it's hard to compare. I mean, there are other good strikers as well, but I think this is one of the best strikers I played in this game so far. There are some strikers I tried which come close, but he's something special, I have to say. And yeah, and I would say for the shooting, there's not much to say. I mean, this is like a can, like a wrecking ball. I don't know how to describe it. It's a really, really nice shot and uh, really clinical. So yeah, like I said, there's not much more to say. The dribbling is nice. The shooting is really, really nice. I mean, the shooting couldn't be much more better than it already is. The sprint speed and acceleration are almost maxed out. The dribbling is really, really nice. Maybe some of you uh, don't like the balance, then you can work with the engine, but it's not much more to say. Stamina is really, really nice. He can play till the end of a full game at least. Sometimes also for extra time, if you play him as a striker, it will be no problem. Yeah, there's not much more to say. I hope you enjoyed the clips of him. I hope you enjoyed this review. If so, then leave a like, hit the subscribe and bell button so you get notified about all upcoming videos here on my channel. And if you want to see some specific players, uh, drop a comment down below. And then I say thanks for watching, thanks for your support and hope to see you next time. Bye bye.